Hey there, cartridge enthusiasts. J-Rock here, and I'm going to show you today two different methods for removing black marker from your cartridge. The first method is using isopropyl alcohol or rubbing alcohol. And you can use a cloth, or I stole some of my wife's makeup pads. Those work too. So for the first method, I'm going to remove one name there, Eric Edgren. I have Eric Edgren's copy of NBA Jam. Oh, Eric, you should make sure to put your name on your NBA Jam so your friends don't take it. Okay, well anyways, Eric, you, wherever you are, you gotta let it go. This is my cartridge now, and nobody puts baby in a corner. I, I, I'm, I'm erasing you. Okay. First method is the alcohol. Dampen your cloth, or in this case, my makeup pad, and start rubbing. And as you can see, already I'm getting some off. Back and forth. Still a little bit. Okay, there's still some on, so I'm going to, in this case, use a Q-tip and kind of really go at it. Little alcohol on the Q tip. Okay, so I did get most of it off. It's still a little faint. So I have something to do at the end that we could hope to get the rest of that off. Now for the last name, I am going to use the second method. And that is, I've never used this method before, but I've heard that Mr. Clean Magic Erasers do the trick. So I took one out and I cut off a little piece using a knife. Just cut that down a bit. Now you're supposed to dip it in some water. I have some warm water here. I'm dipping the corner in. Don't want it soaking. Okay, here we go. Last name. It's actually not working as well as the alcohol. Keep it dry. Okay, see there's still a little bit left there. It didn't really work as well, so I'm going to use some of the alcohol that's left. Okay, so, as you can see, I did get most. There's some residual stuff left over, like... Eric, leave my cartridge alone, guy. There is a contingency plan. And that is... Goo Gone. I've heard this stuff is pretty good, but it can be dangerous. Because it could 
mess up your stuff. So it's a good thing that this is only a copy of NBA Jam and not something rare. So I'm going to put a little bit on a makeup pad or cloth, whatever you have. I'm just going to rub that across there. Don't try not to get any on the label because I have heard that it can get under your label and start to remove the adhesive under there. really putting some elbow grease into it but I think I might have gotten it as good as it's gonna get there you can see it's it's much cleaner on first appearance only when you get closer up you can see faintly Eric Edgren I tried to erase you but you came back Ugh. I tried to erase your childhood Ugh. Anyways, thanks for watching, and uh, my next video will be how to remove uh, stickers from your label. Have a good one, and keep on gaming!